Who will be the master chef? Lana and Henry completed one cooking course with their mom. They decided to have a competition to find out who is the best. Let's watch the video and learn about quantifiers. Our cooking course is finished. How do you feel? It was an interesting course. I learned many new recipes. That's right. I'm so proud of myself. I thought I couldn't cook any dishes. I can't agree with you more. It is a victory to learn every single lesson. By the way, you are a good teacher, Mom. So did you have any difficulties during the cooking course? Well, I used to make a lot of messes, but now I always make sure that I have a big bowl for food scraps when cutting fresh ingredients. Great. And you? The most challenging aspect of cooking was choosing the spices and herbs for each dish. Because none of them were similar, but thanks to your course, I'm better at it. You guys tried your best. However, there are still some things you need to learn and practice more. Do you want to take part in one more course with me? That's a great idea, but I think my cooking skills are good enough. I will practice weekly by cooking dinner for us. I don't need another course, Mom. Me too. Learning to cook is one of the most difficult things in the world. I don't want to learn anything else. Okay. Well, you guys gave your best shot after all. Congratulations! But I think my skills are better than hers. No way! Mine are better than yours. That's ridiculous. I am a hundred times better than you. Do you want to compete with me? Sure. I'm going to be the winner anyway. How do you want to compete with me? Let's cook our best dishes and see who will be the master chef. Okay. Mom, we want to have a cooking competition. Can you be the judge? Please, Mom. Well, why not? That's a great idea. We should each have one commas chef. That's great. Who will you choose? Kate. Mine is Thomas. Okay, you can choose whomever you want, but there are some rules for the competition. Of course, every competition needs its own rules. Whatever. What are they? You need to go buy all ingredients by yourself. No problem. I know a lot of stores. So do I. But some spices are similar. Be careful. And I will give you a limited amount of money. Just a little money? Yeah. It makes everything harder. Okay, no problem. I know what I should buy. Most of it is cheap. You have never gone to the market by yourself. I'm confident that I can defeat you. Let's see. The loser needs to have one more cooking course, okay? Okay. It won't be me, so it's fine. I made a shopping list for us. Let me see. There are a lot of things. Do you have enough money? I think yes. Most of them are cheap, so no worries. You need a sprig of rosemary. Yep, that way. Why did you choose beef steak? It is expensive and hard to cook well. I love beef, you know. And also, it required less ingredients. Okay. Do you think that you're going to win? Of course. I'm super confident. 
Little did Henry know, he can't cook perfectly without help. He has Thomas. Is he good at cooking? I don't know, but nothing can defeat me this time. How confident you are. Absolutely. Look what I have. What is that? Henry's recipe and shopping list. Oh my. How did you get that? I saw it on the dining table. It was a bit careless of him. He can't do anything without it. Correct. Let's go. We do need some butter. You need some garlic? Yeah, a couple of the bulbs. Okay. Do you think this is a little too much? No, we need all of it. Oh my god, why is there only a little money left? What happened? I don't know. I thought mom gave us lots of cash. You can pay by credit card. I didn't bring it with me. What can we do now? We may be late if we go back home to get more money. Yeah, we don't have enough time. Leave some unnecessary things. Oh my, I can't. We don't have time. Choose the main ingredients. Okay. I can't find our shopping list. What? I'm not sure. I'm sure I put it on the dining table, but it's gone. What can we do now? I don't know. I can't do anything without it. We're going to lose. It's okay. I will use my memories. I hope everything will be fine. Sure. Yeah, I can remember a few main ingredients and several spices. That is the only option now. Let's go. We don't have much time. Though we lost the recipe, I think we can win this time. Don't underestimate your opponent. I'm not. So why are you so confident? Look what I have. Why do you have lots of money? It's from Lana. I took some of hers. It's a large amount of money. They won't have enough money to buy ingredients. That's right. Bravo! Quickly, there's a little time left. Okay, we should buy some vegetables first. This way. Did we buy tomatoes, Thomas? I don't think so. How about chili? I think, yes, they are over there, but we just have a few. It's okay. Wait a couple minutes. What's up? I think we made some mistakes. What? We need cabbage for salad, not cauliflower. Oh my, what should we do now? There's no option. We have to use whatever we have. Okay. Could you give me some carrots? Here you are. We will cook beef steak with a minimalist recipe. Yeah, we just have a little garlic and a little butter. Luckily, we still have enough money to buy beef. Yeah, it is the most expensive thing. Okay, we will start by marinating the steak. Okay, I will wash all ingredients first. Thanks. Put some rosemary here. Sure, I'm under a ton of stress. Time's up. Finished. Me too, finished. 
I will try Lana's dishes first, then Henry's. Okay. What do you think? It's hard to choose which one is better. I think mine is better. Do you know how hard it is to cook a beef steak well? It's your choice. Mine is better, obviously. Look, it is also presented well. No, mom will choose mine. No way. Calm down. Lana's dish is a bit salty. And Henry's dish isn't cooked well. I think you have several mistakes in the recipe. Neither of you is good enough to be a winner. Oh my. Both of you need to take part in one more cooking course. No, Mom. No, please. Cooking is so hard. All of your dishes are not good enough, and you know the rules, right? Yeah. We're going to start the new course this weekend. Okay, Mom.